we've enjoyed a morning of people talking and presenting at this uh, technology licensee summit. But it's not all about technology, which is a great thing, really. Um, opening up this, these types of topics generally for people to talk about is probably what this is about, isn't it? Oh, absolutely. You know, for us, it's an opportunity not only to engage with our licensees relative to new services that we've introduced or new products in the U.S., but how to leverage those and truly understand from a predictive nature what's, what's happening in their marketplace, what's important to them as a, as a business partner, but more importantly, their customer base, how we can be involved with that. And the other obvious element is, is the networking. You know, the European companies together, the Latin American companies together, they're able to leverage and, and develop a, a greater network, if you will. I mean, it's very, uh, I think, opening this up to um, other suppliers, in fact, um, to, to let your licensees know what's out there in the market. I think it's a very generous thing to do, but it's all in the, for, the, for the better good. Yeah, it is. I mean, you know, we, we want to continue to develop our footprint, certainly around the globe. You know, our technology speaks for itself, but I think it's very important that many of our many of our business partners have diversity in, in their ongoing businesses. And in 30 seconds, what are the biggest issues um, you're dealing with at the moment with um, detecting uh, corrosion or uh, detecting uh, tanks which uh, need attention? I think what we're seeing in the U.S. right now is a very keen focus on fuel quality, especially as it relates to diesel. In addition to the, the corrosion that's occurring in the diesel tanks, there's also an element of bio um, hazard, and we're addressing that through fuel polishing, tank cleaning, and essentially a fuel maintenance program. And these are things obviously that, that are the same everywhere we go, all the way, all the way around the world, hence Absolutely. the conference today. And, yes. and uh, we'll be uh, hearing a little bit more about some of your suppliers and what they've got to say later on. Absolutely, yeah. thank you. At the end of what's been a very, very busy day, eventually I've caught up with Megan Stewart. If you don't know Megan, um, she's basically one of the brains behind the marketing uh, at uh, Technology, and she's the international arm, and she's been able to put together 14, 15 different countries here today, yeah, exactly. which for an event organiser, trust me, I know how difficult that is, changing minds, you know. What a great job you've done, are you pleased? Oh, very, extremely. You know, it's just been absolutely wonderful to get everyone together. It's the first time, it's our first Technology International Licensee Summit. It's the first time we've really intentionally gathered everyone around an event, just focused on them, just focused on supporting them, um, have the same conversations with, you know, licensees from all over. Yeah. Um, and so to be able to connect them together. Um, well, there's nothing like one-to-one, -one, is there? I mean, face-to-face, -face, you can't beat internet or no really internet. Can't. Yeah. Just the relationships we're building here, you know, I know we're all going to scatter back to our respective countries, yeah. but we'll have those connections to fall back on. And it's so much easier to make a phone call when, when you've met the person. Yeah, and, and the good thing, just I'll say the good things is um, that this wasn't about technology, funnily enough, even though it was the Technology Licensee Summit. And they had speakers here from all different areas, and people are just basically contributing to make it a better industry for everyone. So on that note, thank you, Megan.